Well, Jim, right now the focus is on what Congress will do in the coming weeks or months. There are some bipartisan com conversations underway, but the Senate is divided and voters will decide who will go to Washington after the midterm elections. Americans can cast their vote in November for senators or members of Congress that reflect how he or she stands with guns with this issue, this issue, at the top of the voters' list. As lawmakers in Washington debate the issue of guns and how to prevent violence like the devastating shooting in Texas, a push toward November. I think both sides are going to use the gun issue as a campaign issue. Bill Rosenberg is a political science professor at Drexel University. The gun issue as well as abortion is going to be a similar type of uh, wedge issue that's going to be played on both sides. This is John. And Giselle. Democratic Senate candidate John Fetterman and his wife Giselle posting a video on Twitter responding to the shooting and declaring, We must act now to prevent one more. Fetterman's campaign says he would support reform like universal background checks for all gun sales and a ban on military grade assault weapons and high capacity magazines. With a recount pending, it's still unclear who Fetterman's Republican opponent will be, but both leading candidates made guns part of their primary message to voters. As a teenager, I hunted with a 30 out six. Dave McCormick. Dave McCormick, pro gun and proud of. And Mehmet Oz. I've been shooting and hunting my whole life. So when people say I won't support guns, they're dead wrong. Boom! Right now, current members of Congress are in the spotlight. I think it's time that they start to listen to the people, and I think we have a right for safety. But soon voters will decide. Is this something that you're going to be thinking about as you decide who you want to send to Washington? I know, absolutely, I will. Not all feel the same way. What law would have prevented from that nut job from shooting up that school? As horrific as this incident was, there's so many other issues going on right now that we can make a difference on that this particular issue, man can't change this. No matter what we put in place, it's still going to happen. So this particular issue, it doesn't... That's not what I'm voting on in, in November. Now, I reached out to both the Oz and McCormick campaigns to ask what legislation they would support to address gun violence, but I did not hear back. Both did tweet responses to the Texas shooting, McCormick calling the news devastating and sending prayers to the families, Oz saying he was sickened by the horrific act of evil, and saying that we need to, quote, ensure our kids are protected from these senseless acts of violence and feel safe in schools. He did not elaborate on steps to achieve that. Jim? Lauren Make, thank you.